What up guys, it's your girl Rob Rob Butterfly. I'm here today to do your daily message. This message is gonna be for Taurus. If it does resonate, please be sure to hit the like, comment, or subscribe button to my page. Okay, 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 okay. Help your girl build my platform up and help it reach people who need to get my message. You and saying, guys. Taurus, I hope you having a lovely weekend, enjoying your Saturday like me. Oh yeah, and shaking. And you guys already know. If you want a personal read or you need any of my general information, please be sure to use the description box down below. We're going to go ahead and jump right on into this, guys. Before I started and I was doing my quick little meditation for you guys, I'm already getting Taurus, 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 Taurus. <laughs> Some of y'all, it could be y'all birthday. Some of y'all, you know, you're living it up. I don't know, is it Taurus season? I think it is. And you... Some of y'all feeling real inspired. I feel like you feeling creative. You definitely being out the box. Some of my Tauruses are males out here. You rapping, you thinking about rapping. You very, very, you know, uh, cold with words, okay? Some of you guys had like that poetic style of rap. I'm like J. Cole or something like that. Some of you guys could be listening to J. Cole's new album. We're shot. That's my favorite rapper, okay? But I feel like anywho, music is really bringing you a lot of harmony or this is going to really make you feel complete somehow, some type of way. If you want to rap, this is your chance. Go ahead and do it now. Put your music out there. Let people hear what you're talking about, okay? Because you cold. Don't sleep on yourself, okay? You, I feel like the more that you love yourself, the better you're going to get with your words and the com more comfortable you're going to get with releasing your stuff and not being shy. Okay, what I'm saying? You could be waiting just to see where things going to go. You feel like this ain't going to go nowhere, but actually it is. You get what I'm saying? It's going to bring a lot of light. It's your way. A lot of people going to realize that they did need you, that you were talented, that you were successful. A lot of these people going to want to come back and try to start dick riding, but you're going to be like, nah, no thanks. You didn't believe in me when I was down at the bottom. You can't have me now. You get what I'm saying? You ain't worried about no pussy. You're not worried about no no love. What you're worried about is really fulfilling your career, okay? Because like I said, you know that you started from the bottom and now everything that you had prayed for is starting to really come into fruition, okay? All that talking on the phone, the hoes and shit, you really done with that. Right now you focused on your money and your pentacles getting that big, okay? You could be smoking a lot because you realize you had to let go of a lot of things, a lot of people that you really didn't want to, but you realize it's best for you and your career. Plus, you ain't trying to take care of a whole bunch of people when you get this check. You also trying to get rid of a lot of females that's clingy, even if they fuck you good. They just around for your money. You looking for somebody that's going to be independent, okay? You don't care how fine they are. If they think too much, they cry too much, they talk too much, or if they got too many goddamn kids, they stalkers. All that you done with, you want a solid ass bitch, a down ass bitch that really don't want nothing from you. Somebody that's going to cook, clean, take out the trash, you know, come in the house, stay in the house. You ain't got to worry about when you going out. They got some good ass pussy. They don't make you reconsider nothing. Somebody you don't ever want to leave, okay? You tired of dealing with bitches that's dramatic, that blow your goddamn phone up, that talk too damn much. You tired of dealing with people that got, that got kids and you got to be stepdaddy too. You tired of people that just want to chill okay you could definitely be tired of a cancer and, and a leo a capricorn all of that you like all three of y'all got to go period this one right here this who i'm gonna be spending my time on this who i'm gonna be spending my time with you're not gonna be a player no more you're not repressing any more of your emotions you letting it all out and letting it all go you talking to any and everybody like hey this what it is this what i'm doing you're getting everybody in line everybody in check period some of you guys may be feeling like somebody's teeth or their breath is bad because they drink too much coffee and you really want to tell them that or stopping you from talking to them and that is so little and don't be that don't don't, don't, Taurus, don't be that picky now, okay? But I'm really feeling like you're going to start looking past all of these things. Or this is somebody that wants you back or whatever. But I feel like, you know, um, some of my Tauruses, y'all could be NFL players, NBA players, and y'all sexed a lot with people. Some of y'all talk to a lot of people that have a big past. Somebody could be talking to somebody that has a past. But at the same time, you feel like this person completes you. Y'all could be on, you know iffy terms right now you know but i feel like things are definitely going to come into fruition for you guys as well okay um 
some of my ladies, you could be dealing with somebody that got a small penis and you like, God, Lee, I love you, but your penis small. And it really makes you want to leave them. It's like you love this person, but you don't love this person, ladies, because I feel like they don't satisfy you sexually or they don't satisfy you um, all the way. Like they don't fulfill you in some type of way. They might come through, you know, give you money and shit like that. They might be a big time rapper. They might be a big, you know, entertainer. They might make you feel good. But at the same time, you know, you're wrong because you don't want to be with this person. Okay. You definitely don't want to have kids with this person, even though, you know, they give you good head. They don't do nothing with your ass. They don't get that pussy like you want it. Okay. This person could also be a little square and you don't like that because you like people, you know, that really okay so basically you could be used to dating um entertainers rappers and drug dealers and all this stuff and now you got somebody that's kind of square that love you and want to talk to you but you really ain't on it right now Taurus. for my females i suggest i suggest that you really go ahead and deal with this person and see where your life could go because they could really elevate your life you keep on you know trying to deal with these other you know people that really don't have no sympathy don't have no love for you know real love they just want to you know use your body up, come through late night, leave you with BV and all this shit, be rich and cheap, and might have some good dick, you know, but all they see you as is some sweet pussy, okay? You may be addicted to that, and that can go for male or female. You could be male if you're watching. You could be dealing with females, you know, that got good pussy and sex you real good and all this shit, but at the end of the day, they ain't doing nothing but, you know, stanking up your room with fishy odors, and that's it, you know, telling you what you want to hear. You know, you want somebody that has the complete package. They got the sexy body. They give you good, they fuck you and sex you good. They also take care of themselves mentally and physically, okay? Somebody that you can be a parent with. Somebody that you can leave a legacy with, okay? Somebody that y'all can have some spoiled ass little kids and do the damn thing with, okay? You're not looking for anybody that has a minimum wage mindset, okay? I ain't talking about minimum wage job or minimum wage mindset. You want a bitch that's about her money. You want a man that's about their money. You want a man that's all about you, period, okay? You and nobody else, okay? You didn't realize who ain't there and who ain't your real friend, which who snakes and who not. And Taurus, I feel like at the end of the day, like I said, you growing up and you maturing. You realizing what you bring to the table and what you want at your table. And that's the way that it needs to be, Taurus, okay? You no longer bullshit and you no longer fucking around with people you don't, you don't, you don't feel like... <laughs> deserves that okay you might have been being quiet lately but i definitely feel like you about to show up and show out and you about to show people what's up okay you could be feeling insecure you could be procrastinating about getting back out here and showing you know or you could be uh procrastinating about you know dealing with someone or something or doing something that you know that you want to do or should do or you still up in the air about doing it but go ahead and take that chance okay because you're running out of time but also tell scorpio that some of you guys could be dealing with scorpio some of you guys could have scorpio highly aspected in your chart and that's just what it is stop procrastinating go ahead and take this leap of faith and do what it is that you need to do taurus and you know what i'm saying you already didn't put one foot at the, at the dough go ahead and make that other step don't stress out of the fence you get me so if you gonna love yourself love yourself all the way but well okay don't have stepping now Taurus. y'all know better than that some of my tours is y'all gonna be out here really enjoying your birthday or enjoying somebody's birthday tours i do want to say be safe while you're driving child don't be trying to you know move too fast some of you tourists could be enjoying sunday fun day make sure you're watching out for the kiddos on the road some of my tours is it's your kid birthday and you're trying to make it spectacular don't worry as long as you're giving love hugs and there for your baby they're gonna enjoy it anyway some of y'all are worried about Mother's Day. Don't stress if you can't get your mama nothing real good for uh, this Mother's Day. Give her a love, a hug, and bake her a cake. You get what I'm saying? Some of y'all mamas love strawberry cake with vanilla icing, cream icing. Somebody mama loves that or lemon cake with cream icing. They just love cake like that. So bake a cake for your mother. If you can't go out and about this year, bake a cake for her. Send her a sweet text or hand write her a message, okay? For you guys that you have lost your mother, um, 
this year make sure you surround yourself with people who give you that nurturing kind love feeling that your mother used to give you make sure you eat a good home cooked meal watch you some good movies try not to get too down let your mother know that you love her and you miss her and just try to be thankful for the time that you guys did get to spend together okay that's my message for you Taurus. if it resonated please be sure to hit the like comment or subscribe button okay okay okay, okay. y'all have a beautiful day enjoy the rest of your night whatever I don't know, but y'all enjoy. Take care, Taurus.